His insatiable appetite for God's work necessitated him becoming a prayer warrior at the Mountain of Far Deliverance Ministry, Warri Delta State. In 2010, he was wrongly accused and driven from the church. I don't want to now leave Matt of Fire on my own ministry uh, before, but uh, something just happened. Along the line, while I, while I was, uh, was a prayer warrior there, something just happened. The people uh, in the church, uh, when they saw what the Lord is now doing uh, you know, through me, uh, the blind see while, while I pray for people. Miracles are taking place everywhere. HIV patients, he prayed for him, HIV disappeared. Sometimes, clutches those who are in wheelchairs, he prayed for them, they stood up and walk. They rise and walk. Things were happening. Then, they call him a name. They said, this man, no. Another mama don't come again. Another mama. No, this man is using another medicine. How can anything he says come to pass? That this is not the way the Olukoya operates. He's operating in another different ways. They came to stop us. And the people don't said, ah, what just a miracle is, is this? While I was with them, it was just only um, eight months uh, to, ten, to ten months. And all those things began to happen. Dr. Luka came for anointing service. He called the original viceers and the pastors. Now listen, he has a revelation that God wants to use Somebody from this Niger Delta. When he saw in the spirit, his ministry no more going to the river area again. Please let all the pastor fast and pray. Whether the man is, is truly coming from his ministry. He went back. They now said, um, this man is, uh, you, know, is uh, you know, we don't understand the kind of, uh, um, you know, part that is behind this guy. So from there, they now gather together and uh, in, they now summon me. Pastors in Martin of Fire Miracle Ministries, pastors gank up against him. They said, uh, well, we don't want you in this place any longer. You have to go on your own place. And when Lukaya came, he gathered all of them. He asked them a question. The other day I came, I told you something. That God wants to use somebody from this Niger Delta. What did God tell you? Did you pray? That how they drove me. We don't want you. When they drove me. And they fasted. When they fasted, God told them, spoke to them. That I am the one called prophet Jeremiah Omoto for faith to do his work. They now send a text message to our phones that truly God called him. Mm -hmm.